John, we have seen telepresence embraced by, in some cases, most highly embraced by governments around the world. Uh, and the United States has been one of the leading markets for adoption of our telepresence technology. So we're obviously very encouraged that in Canada the government's made this a mandate. We should uh, take a look at how we'll be working with our traditional programs and even some accelerators. We'll obviously be working with our Cisco Capital subsidiary there to help make the deployment even more uh, uh, faster potentially. And we'll look at, at exciting new ways and new business models to accelerate that deployment. So that's good news for us. It's good news for Canada. And I think it'll be another example of some of the innovation we talked about earlier. What's fascinating is video captures the imagination of CEOs and government leaders. And they don't think about travel. They think about new model, business models to interface with their citizens, the ability to create productivity advantages, etc. So when you talk to President Calderon of Mexico, he gets it. And he's driving this across his whole government leadership group. And there was actually a picture in the paper the other day with him connected both within and throughout Latin America. If you talk to Prime Minister Harper for our earlier discussion, he clearly understands what video means in terms of changing the way you as a citizen, the way you do health care. If you talk to Prime Minister Erdogan in Turkey, he gets it. And he was one of the first ones to ever do a telepresence session between Istanbul and the target area. Ban Ki-moon, the Secretary General of the United Nations, he is one of the key champions of this, both on a more effective way to communicate it, but focusing on the environmental capability. So you're starting to see leading edge groups around the world leverage this more. I actually would add to what Ralph said, I would like to see the executives in the U.S. use it more, much as many of the executives around the rest of the world do.